Hi, I'm Jessica. Welcome back to my channel. I have a Walmart grocery haul. Um, if you've never seen a video of mine before, I do TV reviews and grocery hauls and also just randomness in my life sometimes and topics. I went to Walmart today. This, I'm not gonna even say this is going to be like a monthly haul because I went to Walmart and they really didn't have many things that I needed. I wanted, honestly, I want to go to ShopRite, but I didn't see the ShopRite circular. And since my kids requested that I do Philly cheese steak mini sliders tonight with fries, I had to go to Walmart anyway. And I thought, let me just pick up some things that I'm going to need anyway for the next couple of weeks. But hopefully Sunday I can go over to ShopRite real quick. My mom told me they had a good sale. And since I already know what I'm making for a Sunday dinner, and I also had to get stuff for Sunday dinner as well. So here I'm just going to show you what I got. This is an overview of the things. Um, we're gonna start over here. I should really start with those. Okay. Um, I have some Hot Pocket breakfast sandwiches this is the sausage egg and cheese croissant i thought this would be a good idea for breakfast in the morning they can pop it in gold and they can eat it at the bus stop and then i have some i was looking for the other one the other barbecue but they didn't have any more this was like the last box and i needed chicken wings anyway for a sunday dinner um i'm gonna do a seafood boil so and I'll do some chicken on the side for my youngest, my nine-year-old. So this is the Friday's chicken wing buffalo sauce. I have the buffalo, I have the buffalo sauce and a honey barbecue sauce. So I'll mix that up because honestly, I couldn't actually find any fresh chicken wings inside Walmart. And since I'm pressed for time, I know I wouldn't be able to go to the meat store, but hopefully I can do that like tomorrow when I wash clothes. And I had some thick and fluffy waffles, um, some thick and fluffy double chocolatey. We prefer these waffles, the Belgian style, and rather than the flat ones. Um, I got some, this is some shrimp for the seafood boil, and <laughs> I also got some chicken cutlets. I got um, this is on clearance, so I'm gonna pop this in the freezer. This was three dollars and twenty cents. I ain't paying seven dollars. And then here's another one for three twenty-two, and this one was six seventy-one. And this is the steak meat I'm gonna use for the Philly cheese steak sandwiches. And I may also use this for um, beef and broccoli, maybe. So, like for the stir fry. So this one was nine ninety-nine, and I bought another one. The hell, is this leaking. And this one was eleven twenty-eight. Now, this this is the best find ever. This um, Purdue Chicken Leg Quarters, they're four seventy eight, dollars and I got two. Listen, it was waiting on me because when I walked up in there, well, when I walked to that aisle and I was picking up cheese, I noticed he was um, marking them, and I was like, oh, great, he's marking them. So I picked up two because this comes in handy when I'm making barbecue chicken or if I'm just making jerk chicken. Honestly, I use this for jerk chicken. Um, I got a gallon of milk. I saw these Easter chocolate chip cookies and these look so good. So I thought my kids would enjoy that. I got some chocolate chip ice cream sandwiches. This is called Hip Chip. <laughs> and some mini um, ice cream sandwiches because my kids requested that they get they wanted some ice cream. I picked up some sharp cheddar cheese for sandwiches. I picked up some delicious pear for tacos. This is the cheddar and asiando, I guess. I said that wrong. I got some provolone cheese for tonight and some Kobe Jack. And this is new because this was new in my Walmart. This is the Sorrento Balance um, Ritz cheese and crackers. It is Pepper Jack and Kobe Jack, natural cheese and mini Ritz crackers. And then some Wheat Thins, Sorrento Balance Breaks. 
Monterey Jack and Mild Cheddar. I picked up some strawberries because my daughter requested them. Like always, a mini for the boys. This is the last one, so I'm guessing they're going to bring out three. Um, the Series 3 because they did not have any other ones. Um, I got some orange juice. This orange juice is not going to make it to the weekend because we drink a lot of orange juice. Well, me, my older son, and my daughter, we drink orange juice. My youngest one does not care for it. He mainly drinks water. And also, I have a case of water, but that's too heavy for me to put on this table. I got three broccoli florets. One will be for the seafood boil, or maybe two. And then one just to have as a side. And I picked up my oatmeal, vanilla oatmeal biscuits for breakfast for when I'm in class. And I picked up this chicken queso fresco salad with creamy avocado dressing. This is so good. I had it before. I really, really do enjoy it. I did enjoy it. I picked up two for when I'm doing homework. And I have a lot of homework, so... I could just sit there and just eat that and don't have to get up. I got Captain Crunch for myself and my child. Lucky Charms for my kids. My daughter requested Pringles for, I guess, the pack with lunch. Ooh. So it's uh, cheddar, original, sour cream, onion, and barbecue. Speaking of barbecue, everything is falling. I was in the aisle. I did not. I was in the aisle looking for Nutella. Oop. And this, I saw the Heinz barbecue sauce. Heinz barbecue sauce, Memphis style, sweet and spicy. This was, this was 60 cents. So... I was like, okay, this is 60 cents. This will be good with some um, barbecue chicken. Um, I picked up some bagels for myself to eat. It's an everything bagel in the morning. And I picked up some grand cinnamon rolls for my kids for breakfast tomorrow. Um, I needed some red potatoes. So these are just ruby sensation bite side potatoes and i like these because i don't have to cut these like everybody can have a little potato for my chop for my nine-year-old i cut them in half um i got myself some blueberry cream cheese uh we have regular cream cheese and strawberry cream cheese i'm allergic to strawberries so i just opt out for the blueberries i'm the only one that's gonna eat that um i also got i picked up some nutella uh, the Tella Go Sticks for like when I'm just if I need a snack while I'm doing homework <laughs> and papers I picked this up I picked up some chips for my kids which I'll show you that in a minute I got some fresh honey smoked turkey breast you better not take out all those minis okay. take out a few that you're going to play with I'm sorry but you know it's real life. <laughs> um, I picked up. I was on this. Oh, let me say, I was on the line. The line was so long. I checked out. I don't know what's wrong. What the hell's wrong with Walmart? But lately, they've had like one line, and it's been ridiculous. So I was self checkout. Oh my god. So I bought. I bought. <laughs> I got two of this Crunch Love granola for my yogurt in the morning. I'm lying. I I do get it for my yogurt. But after a while, I just be sitting, like, reading my chapters for school, and I will snack this. I got my mom on these. It's um, Love Crunch Premium Organic Granola. It's uh, dark chocolate macaroon, organic dark chocolate, and shredded chocolate. I mean, shredded coconut. I don't really care for dark chocolate, but I eat this. I like it. And also, my son can have it because there is no nuts in it. I got onion and garlic. Got some family size cheese doodles because we're going to have a movie night tonight. And I also got some popcorn and other stuff, so I didn't need that. 
um i picked up two of the cajun style smoke and dewy sausage one will be for uh the seafood boil and the other one will be for um pasta and sausage one night um this will this is another one this is a beef sausage because my mom can't have pork so i get this on hand if i'm gonna do another seafood boil when my mom is when my mom is visiting me and she's coming in a couple of weeks so i'm happy to have this on hand so when i do the seafood boil um she can have some of it i got some extra sweet corn honestly this corn is going to be two meals half for sunday and half for during the week i got some fries for tonight i got my kids maple syrup even though i just picked up an extra one i know we have another one in the cabinet and then we need more of this syrup the Cavanaugh we're all out I'm mean, I can't see oh my god waffles for breakfast lunch and dinner um I needed some headphones so I ordered some headphones but Amazon is playing games so I got some hazelnut spread my daughter wanted nutella but i can find nutella besides those little four pack sticks so this is, will do the job i got two single packs of these oinkos great great greek value blend cream key lime flavor and then i just got the original four cups pack this will last me in a week I had to get some fully cooked bacon I got some Pepsi and I got some croissant. I got some Jimmy Dean croissant, bacon, egg, and cheese. This is for during the week, but my daughter does eat these at, on the weekend it, when she gets up in the morning. So it's fine. We needed more paper towel and so I, um, so I can go to Sam's Club to get some more or order some. This is going to hold us over. This is also I this was a random purchase because if you notice my last grocery haul, I did buy the mop. I didn't even use it yet. But I saw this mop, it was sitting all nice and lonely by itself. And I was like, you know what? I need a mop because another reason, the bucket. Because um sis bought a mop, right? Thought she still had the bucket. I've been looking for this bucket for four days now. I don't know where that little mop it actually technically when I first moved in here, it was a bucket with all like a welcome package thing in it. And honestly, I was using it as a mop bucket. I ain't gonna lie. I was using it as a mop bucket and also using it, I clean it out. And then, you know, I use it like if I'm cleaning the tiles, I'm cleaning the baseboards. So in all reality, it, it was multi-purpose, but now it disappeared. So, um... <laughs> Mama bought this, so hopefully it'll clean these stupid ass floors of mine. See, it'll clean this. This I don't know what the hell that is. Oh, that's a cat. That was my fault. Hopefully it'll clean this floor. And yes, I still have the Five Nights at Freddy um tablecloth. I cannot find where I put the other one. So I picked this soap up. This Rio. Okay, first of all, I'm this packet. Look, let's look at the package in for a minute. I mean, come on. You two would buy this. I think it was like $3. But it smells, ah, it smells so good. But I love the blue. Yeah. At first, I thought this was um, soap for a minute. This was on clearance for $4. And I think $0.30. I have the blue, the longer, I think it's 24 ounce. I have the longer one to this. So this would be cool for me to have at the bus stop when I'm putting my kids on the bus because it get real cold over here. Um, this is my son's body wash, my nine year old. He loves his body wash. This is his jam. And if I have to hear him one more time about how he don't have no more. So I made sure, this is the first, when I went to Walmart, that's the first place I went and got his wash, his body wash. Um, I picked up some hefty plates, hefty, hefty, hefty plates every day 
50 count because I'm not doing no dishes. Um, this was my clearance. I love this brand. And I just love the fact that they always have blue items. Blue is my favorite color. It's sickening. Um, this is an ice cream scoop. I think this was like $3 or $2, I think. Um, it was on clearance. This too was on clearance. I don't know if they're getting rid of Tasty in Walmart. But thank you. I have a lot of measuring spoons. But this one I think I'm going to let my kids use. Because they got a cookbook. Well, my nine-year-old requested this cook this cookbook. So he wants to make some stuff out of it. So I was like, fine. And these are colorful and they're playful. So they can use that. I got some sticky flags because I have computer literacy. And then I have this utensil caddy which i'm just gonna put on my table in on top of the table in my kitchen honestly i really don't have like a actual table i'm very picky about buying pieces i have to really love it and i i keep going back and forth between two different tables so hopefully i'm going to make my decision very very soon i think i might have found like a bed a bedroom set for my daughter. I think I might have found a bedroom set for my daughter. I'm still looking for one for myself, my kids or my boys. They have a Pacific. Theirs they want lights in them, which I understand. I think like LED lights and just having lights in your headboards are is like the new wave or something. So <laughs> I I understand that. But, um, yeah, I'm very, very, very picky. It's very weird. Because if I'm going to be here, I, like, really want to love what I'm bringing to my home. I just don't want to just bring something just to have it. So, that is it, I think, in this video. I have to go to the mailbox and go pick up a kid off the bus. Yes. So, thank you for watching this video I just realized I'm mad. What the hell? Oh my God. Ugh. But anyways, like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Um, I have another video to upload. Well, I have to edit it. And that's a lot of my son dropping F-bombs. So I have to, <laughs> um, yeah, it's organizing his minis and stuff. But, um, I will see you in the next video. Bye.